New Balance and Levi's are at it once again, and this time they're collaborating on the 327 Silhouette. Brand new Silhouette, made in Asia, non-heritage pair, okay? If you remember these bad boys over here, these are the New Balance Levi's 1300s, made in the USA. All right, these are made in Asia, and we have all three colorways, okay? They made two for men and one for women, and we have all three, but we're unboxing only one pair. We're gonna do the indigo and navy colorway because these sneakers deserve their individual episodes, okay? If we're down with that, let's do it. Hey everybody, what's up, how's it going? My name is Sean, thanks for being here. All right, unboxing episode, super excited to do this for a couple of reasons. It's a New Balance sneaker, it's a collaboration, it's Levi's, it's the brands that we love. But the main reason is that I've never owned a 327 ever, ever since they released it, since the Casablanca's drop, since the general releases had dropped. I just missed out on everything, probably on purpose. I thought that the 327s were uh, gonna get saturated uh, and it's gonna uh, get the same fate as the X-Racers. I still believe that, but uh, these are the exception, right? It's, it's a New Balance. Uh, it's a Levi's collaboration, and I'm in, right? Absolutely love my Levi's 1300s. And, uh, I love them so much, I got a couple pairs of this, and I'm putting up one pair for sale. It's on Carousel, check me out on Carousel. Follow me on Instagram as well, because I sell sneakers from time to time, all brand new and dead stock, and I'm selling one pair, it's an extra pair, okay? And I love these so much that, you know, I'm, you know, th these just got me, right? Um, I've seen the pictures, but man, these are just, these are just way, way more beautiful on hand. Take a look at that. All right, so what we have here is the blue jean slash navy colorway. All right, and these look nice. Oh man, let's take out the other sneaker. Uh, let me show you the box for a minute. You have this maroon top, okay, and over there you got Levi's four feet, New Balance, co-branding. It's a maroon top over here, and over at the side you have New Balance and Levi's four feet, New Balance, sneaker information, New Balance, uh, the main part of the box is a uh, uh, brownish gray. It's uh, one of those weird colors. It's uh, the in-between of brown and gray. Okay, nice box. It looks uh, exactly the same as uh, the 1300 box, right? But the colors are just different. Okay, so we have the navy and blue jean colorway. Okay, one of the first things you need to understand about the 327 is that they're an asymmetric sneaker. Asymmetric means um, one side is different from the other, and I'll show you what I mean. All right, so real quick, you can see the color difference here, blue and gray, okay? Another aspect of its asymmetric quality is you have your end logo here on the lateral panel, but you don't have that on the medial panel, okay? Another asymmetric property is that you have your denim component here on the lateral side, but you have some kind of uh, um, leather compound that's not leather, that's fabric. Some kind of uh, compound fabric on the medial side, okay? It, it, it's asymmetric, you get the idea. One side is different from the other. Now let's talk about the components. You have a good kind of high quality suede for the accents here at the toe. And uh, that's the same material here that forms part of the eye stay, right? On the other side, that's gray, and that's the same high-quality suede material. You have also the same suede here at the back. The heel tab, the heel counter, okay? Denim, of course, is the highlight of the sneaker. Let me show you the right sneaker, because this one has the Levi's tab, okay? In case, you, uh, if, in case you're wondering, why does the left sneaker not have the Levi's tab, the red Levi's tab? All right, and uh, the, the idea is simple. Um, you're, you're looking at this pair like you're looking at a pair of jeans where only the right pocket of a pair of Levi's jeans 
we'll have this red tab over here. Man, I never realized I'd be this happy to have a pair of 327s here. I've never owned a pair, never, ever, and I'm loving the silhouette by the minute. Take a look at the outsole. Who doesn't love a gum sole outsole, right? Who doesn't love a simple traction pattern that studs all over? The best part about the outsole and probably one of the highlights of the sneaker as well and something that I'm totally blown away by is how the outsole extends out and up, right? And part of that outsole makes for an awesome looking heel cup. Let's take a look at that. Let me show you the tongue and the tongue is asymmetric as well. Split down the middle, you have denim on one side and that, um, I still don't know what kind of material this is. It's, <laughs> uh, it's a flimsy kind of fabric, waterproof, plasticky feel kind of fabric, whatever, right? Uh, denim and that weird kind of fabric on the other side, right? And uh, uh, in the middle right here, that runs from uh, the top of the tongue, from the tongue tab down to the base of the toe is a leather component. Okay, a simple tongue tab over here, NB logo. Right here inside would be your sneaker information. Okay, let's pull out the insole. Have your simple navy insole, Levi's for feet, New Balance. Let's see if that's another color here on the right sneaker. Now they're the same color, right? Um, okay, let's put that back. So, that's about it. I'm gonna show you the laces, by the way. I've always been vocal about how New Balance just makes the best high quality laces out there. And uh, this is no exception. It's a made in Asia pair, but uh, made in USA, made in England, made in Asia. New Balance shoelaces are just the best out there. You have white right here, high quality braid. And guess what? You have a pair of extra laces. This is a pair of navy laces. Um, yeah, navy laces would look good on these as well. We got one thing left to do. Let's do the on-feet shot. And there you have it for the Levi's New Balance 327 brand new silhouette. I'm loving the sneaker. What do you think of the sneaker? Let me know in the comments. Let's have a conversation. These release on a staggered basis December 3 or December 15th. Depends on your region. Just ask your local retailers, okay? They go for 120 US dollars, okay? There you go. Any questions? Let me know. You guys always be safe. I'll see you next time.